What's up guys, it's your boy Pierre Yeti here with another video. This time it's not any Call of Duty or any type of game I'm gonna be talking about. I'm gonna be talking about this guy right here. The Elgato HD60S. Now, I bought this very expensive product and um, I was looking forward to using it with my laptop, which is a, it has an i5 um, third generation CPU. And um, I just kept getting black screen. And I, no matter what I did, no matter how, what drivers they tell you to download for Windows 10 and et cetera, et cetera, I really think most of those videos were clickbait. Um, nothing worked for me. Now, I called the IT from Elgato and this is what I found out. You need to have at least a fourth generation CPU. Any CPU ending with the letter U means ultra low, which means that they it, it runs in a very low performance to increase battery life and um, speeds for uh, your computer, but not for streaming or anything like that. So uh, maybe like surfing the web and things like in that manner. So I found that out. So I, I switched to my PC and I find that it works perfect. It works completely perfect. I got 180 and also too, let me just get this in there. You need to have good internet. If you don't have good internet, don't expect to do 180p uh, and 60 frames per second because it's not gonna work. But I'm gonna step back real quick and so you can see that when I move, it moves. It's right on time, no lag at all. I mean, you don't have to do 180 frames, uh, 180p, 60 frames per second, but I choose, I want that and it works. So this is what, the, basically to get not get a black screen is you have to save up. Save up, get better equipment or get a friend like I did to let you borrow a PC and um, so you could get better streams, man, until you save up and so you could get your own. Um, don't fall for the clickbait. Don't fall for anything and like, oh, this is how you fix a black screen and this and that. No, this is how you fix a black screen. Get better equipment. Get better, uh, save up or use what you can for right now. But I'm telling you right now, if you don't have a at least a fourth generation CPU in your um, laptop or um, computer, it is not going to work. I mean, you may, you pro this. I have a 60 I don't, I have a HD 60 S. I don't know about any of the later models. You might get it to work with the later models, but I know with this one here, it tells you in the back, the specs, this is at least what you need. You see the windows 10, actually yeah, CPU right there, Intel five, a quad core. Uh, that's another thing too. Most PCs have a dual core. It's only two, you need a, you need a quad core, at least a quad core. So um, yeah, that's it for this video. I just wanted to share that um, and you know, hope this helps anybody, you know, uh, with this problem of hoping of fixing it with a low end laptop. All right guys, PR Yeti out.